What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel and uh, thanks for taking the time to tune in and watch the video. Uh, today I got a bait build video for you. Uh, we're going to build us a chatter bait. Uh, if y'all are like me, y'all are tired of paying uh, $16 a pop for chatter baits for the high end ones. And uh, I bought my share of them myself so uh, it hurts when uh, when you lose one. I've used all different all different kinds and price ranges and uh, I'm always tinkering with uh, chatter baits, uh, making my own and building building a few. I've tried the cheap ones you can buy overseas and uh, they work pretty good. Uh, get them for like three fifty, four dollars a piece. Uh, they just don't hold up but they do work and uh, I've caught a lot of fish on them. Uh, caught a lot of fish on the high end ones also. Uh, really like those, I just don't like the high prices. Today, today I'm coming at you with a chatter bait build. Uh, this one's going to cost about six fifty dollars a bait, and uh, in my opinion, these work just as well as a high-end chatterbait, have all the same components as a high-end chatterbait, and uh, my opinion works just as well, or maybe even a little better. What we're going to be using today, guys, is a uh, Booyah half-ounce mobster swim jig. We make lots of colors in these. Uh, this one is the, the numbers. It's uh, white chartreuse. And we're going to be using these uh, switchblade chatterbait blades from Queen Tackle. You can get three of these, three pack for $5.99. So that's about $2 a blade. Uh, the swim jig is $4.50 per bait on Tackle Warehouse. And uh, you pair these two up right here and you got a great chatterbait for way less than uh, high end. And uh, as, you, as I'll show you guys, these... These are made pretty good. They got a stout hook in them, wide gap hook, a good skirt. And uh, the way the head's angled up, it, it comes through the cover a lot better than regular chatterbait. Now it still will get hung up, but it will come through cover a little better, uh, wood cover. So uh, let's get started guys, and uh, we're gonna build this chatterbait out. I'll show you what I mean. All right guys, let's get started. Do y'all mobster swim jig? This is a half ounce. And the three pack of uh, switch blades by Queen Tackle. These are the regular size. They come in regular and large. And they come in silver, gold, or black. These are the silver regular. These blades have two little tabs on the ends of them. They've got a little bar running through there. Little wire comes through the other side and hooks it on the hooks through the hole. All you have to do is uh, take your screwdriver. What you want to do, you want to bend the side out that doesn't have the hook on the wire. A little tab just holds it in place when it's bent down on top of it. So we'll bend that out. Take you a pair of pliers. I'm gonna bend the other side out, the side with the uh, where the wire has the hook on it. I'm gonna bend it out just a little bit, just enough to give it a little play. Just about halfway so it won't pop out. See how that it lets that wire release. All you gotta do is take your swim jig. Run the eye on that wire and it's 
pretty much complete. Just bend them tabs back down. And, uh, I've used these several times on different different baits. I've never had one come loose. Looks like it would pop off out of there, but if you got them tabs bent down like they're supposed to be, uh, this blade will not come off. Or I, I haven't had any instances where it's come off for me. And I've, uh, I've used it a pretty good bit, so... That's pretty much all there is to it, guys. It's easy as that. Um, now, I'm going to pull the weed guard off this one. You can either, either pull it out or you can cut it off. I hadn't thrown it with a weed guard on there, so it may be uh, work even better coming through wood and stuff with that weed guard, but it does pretty good without it. I prefer to have it off, but... Uh, you could probably leave it on there, maybe trim it down a little bit, and uh, probably the ultimate baiting around wood and stuff. We're going to pull that off. Just like that. guys that's it simple as that and for around six dollars and fifty cents uh you can't beat it way better than paying 16 17 18 dollars for a high-end one the way that head on that uh, swim jig's curved up if it hits something it usually will go over the top now it, it still will get hung up but it won't get hung up near as bad as a uh, regular chatterbait it's got realistic eyes on it a huge hook heavy duty uh, heavy wire hook uh, it's got two wire keepers on it so it's got all the features of a high-end chatterbait but you're getting you're making them for way less way less money and uh, you compare that with your favorite trailer and you got a pretty awesome cheddar bait there you go guys So as simple as that guys it takes less than five minutes to make one of these like I said got quality components on it and uh, for way less than the top end brands it's got just as many features uh, the wide gap hook heavy gauge hook two uh, bait keepers on the hook and uh, quality skirt uh, I'm pretty much going to start using these. I'm going to build me a bunch of them, and uh, that's what I'm going to start using. But uh, that's just my opinion on it, and uh, if y'all want to save a little money and uh, have some uh, chatterbaits, have some great action to it, and hold up pretty good, you ought to try these. Uh, I'm going to show you a little video of a couple of trips I went on where I caught a few fish. Let you see for yourself, guys. So I appreciate y'all watching and uh, sticking with me, guys. And uh, thanks to all the new subscribers for joining the channel. It really means a lot to me. Uh, so here's a little action of me catching some fish on the chatterbait. Y'all enjoy it.
guys. There's one spotted bass. Got him on that uh, chatterbait I made. Long little spot. Spotted bass on the chatterbait. Small spotted bass. Cheddar bait. It's a spotted bass. Guys on the chatterbait. That's a chunk right there, spotted bass. Got him on the chatterbait. Another one on the chatterbait. Little spotted bass. Another one on the chatterbait. Spotted bass.
and a chatterbait.